You, like every one of us, are looking for or have already found your other half. But you yourself are a love story in which the halves that composed you have sought and found one another. Any other meeting would have not produced you. The first half of what you are now, the feminine, begins when your mother was an embryo, when about seven million primordial follicles are formed at the level of the future ovarian structure. Until puberty, most of the follicles enter a process of self-destruction, with about 400,000 ovarian cells remaining. Of these, during a woman's fertile life, only about 400 eggs will mature and be released into the fallopian tube, hoping to meet Mr. Handsome. Your second half, the masculine, is part of a batch of about 200 million unique genetic combinations produced every day, the sperm. In this state, they survive only three days, then they're reabsorbed, which means that your existence depended on a window of opportunity of only three days, during which he, and only he, must meet his exact feminine half. In order to meet her, he begins an extraordinary adventure, passing through a labyrinth consisting of the vaginal cavity, the cervix, the uterine cavity, and the fallopian tube, a total of about 20 centimeters. In parallel, the egg is carried like a princess on arms by the fallopian tube thrusters that move rhythmically, impressing a unidirectional movement to the egg. This rhythmic movement is a blessing for the egg and a curse for the sperm, as he will have to climb against the current. In 99.8% of cases, this idyllic journey ends nowhere, as she will meet no one during her 12 to 24 hours lifespan and will die anonymously on the way. However, against all odds, exactly these two halves met and together they became you.